All right, let's interrogate this guy. So you've been stuck in here a week already? Has it been that long? Damn. The time's a little fluid in here. This was supposed to be a simple in and out job. Like home in time for dinner simple. But like banging a, a nickel hooker. Thing I've ever seen before. Quick in and out job. What do you mean? Wonky stuff usually happens when a core goes AWOL, but what's happening is more than that. This place is falling apart at the seams. Hmm. We use the stable field emitter, but it's not working like it's supposed to. What's the stable field emitter? If Mobius sent you in here, shouldn't you know this stuff already? Oh uh, yeah, sure he doesn't know what that is. So, uh, where are the Paragon and Renegade choices? There were five That's my question. Of your team. There was a security force already in here to help us, but yeah. There are five search team members. W wait, did you just say were? I found Baker. He's dead. Huh. Doesn't surprise me. He locked onto a powerful signal and went to investigate. I told the him killer. we should just request extraction and report our findings. Leave the dangerous work to somebody else. But he wouldn't hear of it, being team leader and all. He's Always a had to be the brave one. You ask <laughs> me, there's a thin line between brave and foolish. Yeah. There's a thin line between prudent and cowardly, too. <laughs> hey, Tomato, I'm not saying I'm glad he's dead. <laughs> what kind of asshole do you think I am? I a big gaping one. I'll let you know if I find anybody else. You'd really do that? Thanks. I'd appreciate that. A huge stretched out asshole. As if it was a porn star's ass that fits several dicks into it's it at once. more dangerous out there than I expected. <laughs> Any idea where I can get some weapons and supplies? I tried to tell you about this one signal, but... You didn't want to hear it. Well, I'm all ears now. I picked something up from two Mobius security team members who were talking about weapons caches. Maybe you can follow it and get some gear. Maybe they're out there, can help you out. Now think about it. Come on, okay. man. I'm all alone in here. I could use some protection. Maybe if you hadn't let your last guard take the fall for you. Whatever. I'll mark the signal on your communicator. Ah. Follow it or don't follow it. I don't care. It sounds to me like there's actually side content in this game. See? Rogue Signal. This game has side content, unlike the first one. Those things are pretty tough. <clears throat> Takes a lot of ammo to get them off my back. Do you have anything stronger in here? Not in here, but you could probably find some out there. This place was designed to be peaceful, but Mobius and firepower go hand in hand. Do you know where I can find some of this firepower? It's pretty chaotic out there. You're not going to find a pile of heavy-duty weapons altogether. But I did see something useful next to an abandoned APC just outside. I'll mark hmm. its location for you. Another one. But be careful. There are a lot of those things hanging around it. There you go. So there's actual side content in the game. Here's the map, right? Go outside, use your communicator to track the girl's voice. There's the APC. And there's the rogue signal. Huh. Okay. Some items. Gunpowder. Shotgun shells. No, it's not. It's handgun bullets. Are you kidding me? Dude, that looks blatantly like shotgun shells. Coffee makers. What is this? Drink your coffee at a coffee maker will restore your he full health. Coffee makers automatically begin brewing another pot of coffee, but the process takes some time to complete. What? What on earth? Drinking coffee gives you full health. <laughs> Evil Within 2 brought to you by Starbucks. Enjoy the new delicious flavor of pumpkin spice lattes all autumn long. Only for $9.99 at the local the Starbucks. Off. For a small. <clears throat> There's a save point. Is this a workbench? Oh shit, it is. Nice. Booty call me to the temperatures that I should have an espresso shot. Nah, that's a regular, uh, that's a regular coffee maker. It doesn't do espresso, dude. Crafting and weapon upgrades. What can I craft? Handgun bullets. Medical syringes. And medical kits. So medical syringe takes three. Medic kit takes five. I currently have six. Handgun bullets take two gunpowder. And I have a shit ton of gunpowder. As you can see. What about weapon upgrades? Ah. So... Oh, so here's the catch-22, folks, okay? Right now I'm using this burst fire handgun that's from the DLC, but look, I can't upgrade it. There's no way to upgrade that handgun. Therefore, it's basically what it is now forever, and it's going to become worthless really quick versus this gun. Look how much you can upgrade it, right? 
So let's see. Firepower, how does this work? For 90 weapon parts, you go from 100% to 120% weapon power. And then it hits different levels. Look at that. Once you do two upgrades, right? Then you have to do use a high-grade weapon part to hit level 2 on the weapon. See that? Ah. Reload time, same thing. Reload time, ammo capacity, yep. Fire rate. Well, for now, since I only have the one gun and I'm already using the DLC gun, I'm going to save all my stuff for later. I think that would be the more prudent thing to do. But I should probably make more ammo, considering I only have five bullets. So let's take a look. That would be five bullets. So I can make ten bullets for twenty. Okay, here you go. That's good. Oh! Oh! DIY! Got a bronze trophy for DIY. <clears throat> Yolo Dopper did a 10 bit cheer and says, Do you think the Steve Jobs guy will survive till the end? Absolutely not. He is going to die probably within the next hour. Field crafting. Select the field crafting icon from the arsenal menu to craft items without using a workbench. Field crafting consumes more resources to craft to get a workbench, and you cannot upgrade weapons. So basically, you could just make bullets, right? That's what you're looking to do ammo in the field. There it is. Okay. Well, it's good to know if I run out of ammo, I can make ammo on the fly. I don't think it would be very wise to use more crafting materials, though, unless I have to do it absolutely. <clears throat> okay. Let's go ahead and save. Very nice. Chapter 3 Residences. All right. All right. Let's see what we got out there. Our first actual open world gameplay. Oh shit, what's this? There's more stuff in here. More weapon parts. Look, more weapon parts. What's out here? Oh, there's an upstairs. What is this? Bathroom. That's right. Oh, this is where I came from. Duh, this was the entrance. What was the other door then? Wait a minute. Oh, you can't go out this way. It's blocked. Alright, so there's nothing here. I gotta go back down. Shit. <clears throat> Oosh. Fuck that shit. Fuck that door. Alright, now we gotta go outside. Oosh. Fuck that door too. Um... Okay. I'm assuming this is the way out. Oh, wait a minute. What the fuck? Was that a nurse? What the... Who is that? Fucking naughty nurse. Let's find out. That, wait a minute. Was that the nurse from the first game? Listen. It is. It's the music from the first game. No way. We're back! Are you kidding me? We're okay, we're back to the uh We're back to the office. We've come back. Oh, there's a workbench here. Oh shit! It might be the nurse from the first game. There's a workbench. Wait a minute, is this where I upgrade? Just like the first game? Yup! No way. Yeah, look. It teleports you back to the first game. <laughs> okay, then. She's back. What the hell? Hey, let me out of here. Detective Castellanos. <laughs> what a pleasant surprise. Welcome back. You again? How are you here? I could ask you the same question. Regardless, it's nice to see a familiar face. Even if that face has seen far too much. <laughs> you look tired, detective. I can help you get back in shape. Whoa, she grabbed his balls. Very nice, she cupped them. Cupped the balls. Just like before. Alright, let's look at the upgrade tree. 
<laughs> Booty call me. It says time to shoot a creatine right into your veins. Let's see how much they cost. Oh, good lord, dude. They're insanely expensive. Are you shitting me? Look. The cost is out of control. 8,000. First one's 1,500. I can't do any of these. I can't afford them. I only have 900 green gel. I can't even do the very first level upgrades. At least I know they exist now. Whoa, consume a red gel to unlock further skill progression. That must be a rare item you need. Yep, red gels. I can't do a single one. Nope. I don't understand. This place. You. It's just like Beacon. But this isn't Beacon. This is Union. Is it? It all seems familiar to me. Ah. These walls. That chair. You all, oh boy. It's I think. as if nothing has changed at all. I think we got a big hint. I think that literally just gave us a big hint. I don't think they ever really escaped the machine. I don't believe it. Because if you remember... At the end of Evil Within, the first one, the canon ending for just a regular game, they're all still in the machine. At least you think they might be. It shows them leaving, but it's not clear. If you play the DLCs, you find out they are still in the machine, but it was actually Kidman who's trying to get them out. But it's not clear, even at the end of the DLCs, if they ever get out of the machine or not. Now, at the beginning of this game, they were like, oh, it's been three years. How much you want to bet it's all bullshit? How much you want to believe they're still in the machine from the first game they never got out? And that's why he still can talk to her and get the upgrades and everything. That's I guarantee that's what it's going to be by the end of the game. They're still in the same fucking machine. They never got out. They're, in the they're still in the first stem. <clears throat> I guarantee it. That's my, that's my guess. Oh, nice self-opening doors. This is how you go back. Anything new here? Did the cat show up? There's a cat. Hello. Projector. I don't have a new slide or anything for the projector. I probably won't get one until I beat the first official chapter. Yeah, I don't see anything new. No, nothing. Nothing's changed in here. I just wanted to see if maybe something changed. There was a reason to come back, but everything looks the same. Right? Yep, everything looks the same. Alright, let's get out of here. Wait, was that coat here last time? I don't remember that coat being there, but maybe I'm wrong. <clears throat> Alright. There we go. 